It's appalling. It's absolutely appalling. Um, and it has to be called out in the strongest possible terms and condemned. I was there at Wembley last night. I could see what that meant uh, for the players losing. I could see what it meant for everybody in the ground and everybody across the country. And this team have been brilliant role models on and off the pitch. They've had the courage to call out racism and stand up for equality. Um, and they've shown real leadership. Gareth Southgate and the team have shown real leadership. And this is about leadership. And I'm afraid the Prime Minister has failed the test of leadership because whatever he says today about racism, he had a simple choice at the beginning of this tournament in relation to the booing of those that were taking the knee, the players that were taking the knee. And they made it clear why they were taking the knee. The Prime Minister failed to call that out. And the actions and inactions of leaders have consequences. So I'm afraid the Prime Minister's words today ring hollow. But how much personal responsibility do you think he holds for this? Leaders' actions and leaders' words and leaders' inactions have consequences. Um, and the Prime Minister had a very simple choice at the beginning of the competition. Did he call out the booing uh, of the players taking the knee? And they were clear we're standing against racism, the very thing we're discussing today. We're standing for equality. And the Prime Minister failed to call out the booing. So whatever he says today rings hollow. And like all football fans, I stand with Rashford, Sancho and Saka uh, today on this really important issue.